Assalamu alaikum friends. How are you all? Hope you are doing fine. So, this video is really about the books. Those very books which I think every book lover should read. I have got, I won't say a huge collection of books, but there are certain books in my collection. And I would say those are the gems which I like to have in my trousseau. So that's it. Jo aap se aaj share karna hai ki wo hai I think 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 books jo very close to my heart hai and I think every reader should read this. They are simple, coherent and wonderful. And I think let's start this video. Hope you would like this video. This video is just for the entertainment and the educational purposes. So I hope this would be helpful to you. So the first book I would like to share with you is Like the Flowing River. It's by Paolo Selho. I don't know. Am I pronouncing it right or wrong? Is it Selho or something else? But it he is the author of The Alchemist. That is also the big book which is also very close to my heart and which I really like to read and reread. So, so first book is like the flowing river. It's again a very nice book. So he was born in Brazil and has become one of the most widely read and loud authors in the world. So he's renowned for the alchemist 11 minutes. So for alchemist perhaps he has sold more than 100 million books worldwide and has been translated into 66 languages. My goodness. So this book is very simple and perhaps it's one of those days, one of those very first days when I started setting up my simple library. So these are simple, what should I say, snippets or something like that. And so this is the content, you will go through it and yeah, I would like to share with you the very first thing that I read from this book and I got attracted to this and I, it took me no seconds or it took me no time to buy this book. It's about the story of pencil yeah the story of pencil it's very nicely written and what should I say this is perhaps the story that teaches us to be generous that teaches us to be nice and the this story is that which I mostly share with my son and he likes to listen to it so let me see this is at which page number this is at page number seven page number seven okay let us go through it i will read, read a bit from it okay so that you would get an idea what this book is all about Yeah, this is it. So a boy was watching his grandmother write a letter. At one point he asked, are you writing a story about what we have done? Is it a story about me? His grandmother mother stopped writing her letter and said to his grandson, I'm writing about you actually, but more important than the words is the pencil I'm using. I hope when you like this pencil when you grow up, you will be like this pencil when you grow up. Intrigued, the boy looked at the pencil. It didn't seem very special. So this is it. And you will say, finally the pencil fifth quality. It always leaves a mark in just the same way. You should know that everything you do in life will leave a mark. So try to be conscious of that in every action. So this is really very nice book and I think every sh reader should read this. Padni chahiye ye book. Achhi lagegi aap logo ko. 
So the second book is also from the same author and this is really this is really a very nice book the alchemist it's a fable about following your dreams so so let's read a bit from the prologue of this book the alchemist picked up a book that someone in the caravan had bought leafing through the pages he found a story about narcissus the alchemist knew the legend of narcissus a youth who knelt daily beside a lake to contemplate his own beauty he was so fascinated by himself that one morning he fell into the lake and drowned at the spot where he fell a flower was born which was called the narcissus so this book is also very nice and hope you would also read this book so the third one is nicholas sparks the notebook so this book has always already been filmed and the quality of the book is very nice as per the standards of language is concerned if you want to have that command over english you should definitely go through this book this will help you to improve your vocabulary and sentence structure the another one is the fault in our stars it's by john green this too is a very nice book and it's new york times best seller so this too is a widely read book and one of the reviews i would like to read before you it's filled with dark humor and written with a beautiful simplicity that draws the reader in so deeply that it is not just the twists and turns but the gentle bends and curves that you feel tugging at your emotions so this is review by daily express and the one or the another book so it's basically an autobiography it's an autobiography of benazir bhutto and i think this autobiography should be read by every muslim woman so this is really a very very comprehensive book a very coherent tale of a very bold woman so this should also be read by a woman during her lifetime so this too is very nice so another book or the another jewel is Alice Munro's sorry it's Alice Munro's lives of girls and women this too is very well written and i won't be at this time giving you the review of the book because i don't have that much time at my hands but this is written by a canadian author elis munro and she is really very close to my heart and i really really feel of her as an inspiration to me so this too is a very nice book and i think every reader or every woman should read this also and the last book which i like to share with you at this time is little women my goodness this is by lucia may alcott one of the beautiful things in this book is that it's i think it's contemporary contemporary in the sense that whatever or we do in our lives or hum chahe jitna bhi uncha jaye zindagi mein at heart we really that small girls jo is book mein hai this is about a mother and her daughters and also about the protagonist of the book is a writer and that she is destined to become an author and yes at the end of the story she turns out to be like that and this is a very tender story of a family 
so they are in their small vanities but yes they are interconnected and they feel for each other that is the beauty of this book hope so you would go through these books excuse me don't excuse me for this thing uh, <laughs> i hope you won't mind it because this is there okay i hope you have enjoyed the video and do subscribe to my channel hope so you would surely buy one or the other of the collection and i hope in the future i will surely give you more from the book side okay thank you